Hi, and welcome back to the Reverse Engineer. In the last video, I opened up a fire alarm pulse station. We found out that there's not a lot inside except for a toggle switch. Today, we're going to be looking at how a toggle switch works. This toggle switch hasn't been working properly for a while. Hopefully we can get an idea of what might be wrong with it when we open it up. Now that we've removed these other pieces, we should be able to separate the metal from the plastic. So as you can see here, we have these little pins with a spring attached on the bottom. There's another one of those right here. So those two fit together. So let's try and reassemble this, just so we can see what we have here. Let's put the contacts back in the way they were. So you can see those contacts actually sit in a little cradle. So this fits in here. And as you move it up and down, those contacts will then either turn on or off. Looks like this one has had some arcing going on inside, which is probably why one of these is so oxidized and damaged. And that's why the switch wasn't working very well in the first place. So I'm just going to lay all of these components out here so you can see what we have inside a toggle switch. We have the main housing and the two contacts that fit in there. Then we have this swivel which makes contact with these little two pieces with a spring attached and then the knob on the toggle switch which is mounted inside this top plate. So there you have it. Those are all the components inside a toggle switch. Hopefully that gives you an idea of how a toggle switch works. I'd like to make more videos like this, so if you enjoyed it, leave a comment and subscribe. Thank you.